I thought I had it all together But I was led astray The day you walked away You were the clock that was ticking in my home Changed my state of mind Love so hard to find So you want to learn how to do the shake effect. Well, you come to the right place. First of all, you're going to need the Sapphire plugin. There's a download link and instructions on how to install it in the description. 100% absolute virus free. So don't complain. Once we have installed those, we can continue with the tutorial. For this example, we're going to be using a video, but you can use an image or just plain text. Now go into video effects and find the plugin called S underscore shake. You will only have one preset called default. Drag that preset onto your media. Now there's two main sliders we're gonna be using, amplitude and frequency. Amplitude is pretty much how far the media can go and frequency is how fast it can shake. So just an example, we can turn the amplitude to about five and as you see, the video is totally out of frame. So if we play it, it's gonna be all over the place. So it's pretty much the less amplitude is, the more centered it is. With frequency, it's pretty self-explanatory. If we put that to about 30, it's going to be really shaky. So to get a kind of smooth camera, kind of smooth camera shake, I would put amplitude to about 0.2 and frequency to about 3. Creates that nice camera look. Okay, now, there are other options in the S underscore shape plugin, like motion blur, or the seed. The seed is pretty much, it randomizes the motion, so it's not the same every time you put it on media. So we can turn that, so it has a limit of 5, which is basically 5,000 seeds. So just go and choose any one you want. It doesn't change how fast or wide the shake is, just the motion path. That is it. That is the plugin. We can also use this plugin, as I said, on images or text. Let's put on the default preset. And wow, look, the image moves. Let's put it on the text. And wow, oh my gosh, no way. The text moves. That is amazing. So it's just like that. Simple plugin that makes everything move that you place it on. It's really fun to use, especially in MLG videos. But anyway, thank you guys for watching this. If you have any ideas for tutorials, please leave them in the comments below. And I'll be sure to check them out because I have nothing to do. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and finally know how to do the screen shake effect as you've all wanted. And have a good night.